everybody? Nash Harrington with Crave Online here at Formula Drift. Today we're in Long Beach, California, and I'm hanging out with Ken Gushi. Ken, can you tell me what it's like to be a part of a sport like Formula Drift that has grown so much in the last few years? Oh, it's amazing. You know, I've seen the sport grow since day one, and I was here in the first year where, where they brought Formula Drift, and um, just to see the growth and how, how well it's known now, it's just amazing. And you see all these drivers with these fixed up cars and all this, like, you know, bling, but it's, it wasn't like this before. We just had street cars that were kind of beat up and we're trying to make it happen, but now we see all these uh, factory back teams and we got here my sound racing car, so it's a pretty big deal now and it's something really special to me. What was it that drew you to drift racing in general as opposed to some of the other motorsports? Drifting is sort of a way where I can like portray my personality, my character. It's kind of like an outlet, you know, you have a rough day, you just go out to the racetrack and just go drifting, you just forget about everything and uh, you know, here for the professional circuit with Formula Drift, it's just all about, you know, who has the biggest balls, you know, who takes yeah. the biggest risk, and it's just showing the crowd what you're made up of and how, how you're going to attack the course in the competition out there. When you do have some free time, what do you do? Um, besides this car, I have another practice car that I keep, you know, up to date with the maintenance, and I go out to a local racetrack and just keep drifting, and I also spend a lot of time with the grassroots crowd, teaching them how, how to drift, and, you know, just staying around the scene, staying around cars the whole time, so it keeps me conditioned for competitions like this here at Long Beach. Otherwise, I like to go shooting. Okay. I build myself a nice AR-15 and just <laughs> take that out and just blast some uh, dirt and clay. <laughs> We're a couple days away from the race here in Long Beach right now. What is part of your routine to get ready to go out on the track? I mean, the most important thing is to just stay focused and remember what your role is and, you know, to make sure the team knows what their roles are too. And if all that comes together, you know, the teamwork, the car prep and everything, it sh we should have a good weekend. But it's just making sure the car is up to par, um, maintenance is done, the car is reliable, and uh, we're out here uh, trying to showcase what we have.